What's up guys, today we got an engine intake for Jenny and we're gonna install that right now. How much horsepower do you think this is going to add? So we got the factory air box out of here and we're getting ready to put the heat shield together. So we're going to put these rubber strips on there to keep it from rubbing up against stuff. And then this, it's kind of like a seal I think. This goes on the top of it. So we got to trim these rubber pieces. I had to trim both of them because apparently engine doesn't know how to tell the circumference of a circle. So What's the formula for a circumference of a circle? E equals MC vagina. And they obviously don't know that equation. It don't make any damn sense to me. Are you having fun now, Ryan? No. It's like the worst designed intake I've ever seen in my life. They got this designed where it's at an angle in the back, so you can't go straight down on the bolt because that's there. So you have to go at an angle like this, which means you're almost stripping the head off the bolt and it's trying to cross thread the bolt at the same time. Would you say it's a worse design than the Prius? Probably. How was it? Not bad. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it though. You'd go with a different intake if you had to do it again? Yep. There was just a lot of stuff wrong with it. Like that bolt down there is a pain in the ass. Um, there was a shield, like a shroud, that was supposed to go over here that didn't quite fit very well. And, it was just a real pain to do. All right, so we got the intake installed now. Um, it's not gonna do a whole lot performance wise, but maybe a little bit audibly. <laughs> maybe, might make it sound a little bit better. So we're gonna start it up and see what it sounds like. I made your exhaust a little bit earlier. Pussy. 
All right, guys, that was the install of the engine intake on the 2013 Genesis Coupe. This is the 3.8 V6. Install could have been a little bit easier. There were some things that were a little bit more difficult than it should have been. But overall, it's a pretty easy job. Any intake you get is pretty easy, but they made it a little bit more difficult than it should have been. Um, you do get a little bit more sound from it. It sounds pretty, pretty decent. Probably not much on performance, but... You know, the only reason I would recommend getting an intake for this car is if you just want the sound because basically that's all it's doing is making the induction sound. Um, I didn't notice it pulling any harder. I, didn't, I don't think it has too much power gain. Um, I'm hoping it does help on fuel efficiency. Maybe I'll bring my MPGs up a little bit. That'll be awesome if it does, but I don't know. Alright guys, thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, be sure to leave a like on it. Let's try to get 3,000 likes on this video. Get some 3,000 cheeseburgers. If we reach 3,000 likes, in the next video, Ryan will eat a whole cheeseburger. Leave a like on the video. Check out our t-shirts in the description. Check out our Instagram, Twitter, all that stuff in the description. And have a good day. Call that balling. Doing this is my calling. Flow is so appalling. My phone off and she calling. I'm like, yeah, what it do? Penthouse, man, what a view. I'm too good for my own good. I won't leak the album. I let it spill. Number one, bitch, I...